Hi, this is a demonstration on how to set up your archive in on Outlook 2010. What you need to do is start Outlook and go over to File. Once you're over at File, you go down to Options and then down to Advanced. And then you will see on there that you've got Auto Archive. Reduce mailbox size by deleting or moving old items to an archive data file. Now, like us, we've got um, Outlook set up on our servers. The servers are getting rather full with emails. So by setting up Archive, an Auto Archive, you remove emails from the server and store them locally on your local drive. So what you do is click Auto Archive Settings and then you get this dialog box. Now as you can see I've clicked Run Auto Archive every 14 days. You can change this to whatever you particularly want it to be but 14 days is probably about OK. Now this particular one, if you tick this one, it will prompt you every time it archives. I've actually taken the tick out so it doesn't prompt me and it will just automatically archive. You can leave all the other default settings. Apart from this one, you might want to uh, set this one up to say four months so it clear everything out from four months. But if you feel you want to you know, keep everything on the server for say six months, then that's fine, but you won't actually lose anything. You'll be moving it across to your local drive. So I've set mine to four months. This particular address will be just a default, so I wouldn't change that. I would just leave that and then just click OK, then OK again, and then that's the auto archive set up. But now we actually need to run a manual archive to help clear our server. So the way that you do that is go to file and you come down to clean up tools and if you drop that one down you'll see that it's got archive option just there. So you click that one. Now at the moment I've got the inbox highlighted. Now if I just click this one here, archive all folders according to the auto archive settings so that will do every th all the folders so now click OK and that will start to archive and you'll see down, down the bottom here all folders are up to date archiving and it's going through all my folders and it's as simple as that